How's it going, Fan fans? Welcome to another episode of Linear Subscriptions. Today we're checking out why we went on finding from the channel Isaac Butterfield. Now this video sounds absolutely controversial and insane, but Isaac Butterfield typically has good points to make. So I'm really curious about what he's going to say. He obviously got a lot of hate for this video. Yeah, get a, get a, fucking very Australian, get a. Can I just say, before you freak out, watch the whole video. Okay, I, I will, all right? I haven't freaked out yet, I'm watching the video. All right, see what you have to say, all right? If it's controversial, I will I will tell you. All right, before you get your little journal out and start writing for Junkie Magazine or BuzzFeed or one of you dickheads, just hear me out. Okay, okay. let's, yeah, yeah, because pe people would take that title and then put it as a headline that Isaac Butterfield is a sexist because he thinks women aren't funny but you have to watch the video to understand what he's coming from so yeah and favourite colleagues at work or your friends <coughs> at school or just 10 people that are around you now if you're a male or you're female you probably have a very similar answer rank them as the least funny I mean, being to the most funny to the most funny being number one now okay. chances are now this is just an average maybe you completely disagree chances are Top five would be majority. I didn't do this, now, but yeah. Why is that? Well, we're about to find out. Really, let's think about it like this. When someone, okay. one of your mates goes on a date, or you go on a date, what are the questions you get asked? Who you paid? Woman, Did you pay? You say, oh, the date was great. He was really funny. Right? Okay. If you're a man, sure. you're probably going to say, the date the she was, hot. was great, mate. I had a great time. Uh, she was really nice, really good looking. Yeah, see, there, there it is. animals. Do you see what I'm saying? We don't really mention funny. Let's just remember that we are animals for a moment, and one of the key we are, that's true. We are here on this earth is to procreate and make more more of us. What is a man's most attractive feature? You may be saying big arms or, or abs or whatever, but in reality, it's actually how much they can make you laugh, how much they can entertain. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Women are more into personality, men are into looks. It's how it is. We think with our dicks, women think yeah. with their brains. They start to think, okay, this guy, you know, he might be a hot dude on fucking Love Island now, but in three years' well, time, fuck he's Love Island. Have fuck up show. Airline. Don't watch it. <laughs> he's gonna have bloody psoriasis on his face, he's gonna be a big ugly fuck, and, uh, you know, our relationship's gonna be over. The female would much rather find someone who they actually enjoy being with because it has a long term future. The problem lies in the fact that most men are unattractive. Like, what's attractive to one person is not attractive to the other, I get that. But most men are not attractive. Like so you, they for example. On being funny. For a man to walk into a nightclub and try to pick up a chick, it is tough work. You gotta get dance moves down pat. You gotta be funny in the conversation. You gotta try desperately hard not to be a creep, and that's tough. But for a woman, all they have to do is turn up and not be obese. That is literally... No, 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 well, they, they have to show up with their cleavage out. Get it right. To reaffirm my point that I'm trying to make here is men are funnier than women. Women are still funny, but <coughs> men are funnier. And why is that? Well, men are pigs. Our jokes are usually mean, horrible, disgusting, just absolutely not True. okay for the public yeah. context. But we tell them anyway. Funny women obviously exist. Amy Schumer, back in the day before she stole people's jokes and started carrying on better than me too. Me, uh, Miss Pat, she's hilarious, right? Roseanne Barr, there's heaps of them, all right? Even in my house right now, Mrs. Butterfield, all right? Yeah, Mrs. Butterfield. Those Tinder profiles. Where? Sh 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 I, I want to see her right on here. She is the funniest person that I've ever met. No one has ever in my entire life, comedian or no, has ever been able to make me laugh in the way that she does. In other words, women don't care about being funny. Men fucking do. Of that's very true. People disagree. But obviously, female comedians obviously want to be funny because that's their, that's their job. So yeah. If you've never seen a woman make be funny, then you're just a sexist asshole. And so. <laughs> what if what if you've never seen a funny woman in your life? Are you still sexist? Like, like if you don't if you don't ever see a black person, does that does that make you racist? Like, what's the what's the logic here? I don't know where it comes from. It comes from. If you say that, then you hate women. That is fucking stupid. Why would that mean that you hate women, you fucking... You're just grasping at straws, something shocking here. This is a great way to reaffirm someone's argument, is just to say, well, if you don't agree with me, then you hate everybody with a vagina. I, I, I think that then you are not open to hearing what women have to say, and you're probably not funny, and you're probably threatened by women who can command attention in a room. Why? 
A lot of people think that men are intimidated by funny women. I've met a lot of female comedians, some that are great, some that are fucking terrible, and they still get gigs because they're chicks. <laughs> anyway, um, no one's intimidated. I'm not either. Particularly in the funny world, people just want people to be funny. That's it. I want to know what you guys think. I, 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 just, I don't really understand, subject, personally. There's so much nuance in the argument, my argument, just to boil it down into a sentence, is men care more about being funny than women do, men try to be funny more than women do, and men rely on being funny more than women do. That's the argument, all right? Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know if you're a racist, sexist, misogynistic piece of shit. Or maybe I'm just a little bit right. Ladies and gentlemen, be a good motherfucker. Peace and peace. Well, that was weird. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to click like. I think Isaac Butterfly had some really good points in that video. Um, you, you may not agree, but you have to remember that men and women are very different. Yes, but we're, we're all human. But, you know, if you think about it, men are better at sports. Women, women are better at reading and cooking and because we're built very differently. Check out yesterday's link in the description over there. Or check out my brand new series where I look at pictures over there. And I've also started doing sketch comedy on Monday. Click there to check out my newest video. Or click there to watch my newest Lin Valley Reddit. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another episode of Lyndon Looks at Blank. It's Lyndon Looks at Pictures of Blank, you fucking idiot. Come on, this is your show and you can't even say the name of it.